And we're here with Chief O'Leary. And Chief, thank you so much for having us uh, out here today. Well, I'm pleased that you could experience some of the new technology changes that we have here at the new police and public safety building. It's, it's very impressive, not like the old days. Well, certainly when I started my law enforcement career, some of the things that you saw today uh, for the residents that watch the show were only dreams uh, for any law enforcement agency, and right. we're trying to stay up with the different changes in technology to make the staff more effective and efficient. I'm very impressed with the technology that you have here. I have to, I'm also a little surprised, our little hometown of Foxborough, which we used to know as Mayberry RFD back when, when I graduated here, I think we're kind of coming up into the uh, 20th century, 2010 is here. Well, I'm very fortunate. We have some very talented staff members that uh, keep us abreast of what's changing in the law enforcement environment and want to make sure that my staff has the best equipment available so that they can do their jobs in a more professional manner. That's terrific. And is there anything that you'd like to add? I know we went and we took a look at the fingerprint identification system, and I know that you told me you've had some real good success lately with that system, correct? Certainly we had, uh, with the live scan system in particular, we've had six separate incidents where we've been able to verify a person's identification and in four of those cases people have actually given us false information mm -hmm. which has resulted as additional charges for them. Right. So that helps make your job a little easier, correct? It certainly does and you know it makes things uh, I think more effective for the criminal justice system in general. Now, we focus on technology today mostly on how technology is today, not really in the future, but how it is today and how it's actually working, not this hypothetical thing that might happen. But just to kind of break that mold a little bit, where do you see the future of law enforcement going? Is there anything kind of on the close horizon that we're seeing? I'm sure that you're kind of up to date on what's been going on lately. Well, certainly we've made uh, two major jumps within the past year in terms of bringing the technology that's readily available now in a cost-effective manner to the community. Uh, there are numerous initiatives that are undergoing study now, uh, but I think it's too early to uh, broadcast them uh, and talk about them in any detail. What I think would be effective, Ron, is if you could come back and do a shift on patrol with the officers and see the application of what the officers have available in the real world environment because that's where it's important that it works uh, whether it's the uh, ability to control prisoners uh, with the use of the taser devices the officers carry uh, everyone wears uh, the calvar you know protective vests uh, for their own protection and the use of the computer in the cruisers is a different avenue than when I first started my police career in the early 1970s and I actually had a call box key. If I had a problem, I have to get to a call box key where I was. So things have changed dramatically from uh, in my professional career and I think the new officers that are starting today with what we think is new technology will probably look back at the end of their 30 years and think, wow, look how far we've come. That's true. And that's what technology today is all about, is helping make our lives easier. Remember, there's never been a better time to be alive, and Chief has just kind of brought that. Remember the time when we used to be here with the call boxes back in the day. So, folks, thank you so much for coming out. It's been a pleasure serving the community. My name is Ron Healy, your host of technology today for Chief O'Leary and the rest of the staff here at Foxborough Police Department and Safety Building. We'll see you at the top.